Hello my friends and welcome to page two and three of my Project Life pregnancy album. Here's some still photos of my second layout that I actually made but it will actually be the first page in my book. Um, so here I just want to show you the close-ups again of what I did. I included stamping and again alphabet stickers and some wood veneer and washi tape here. And I found again I, I'm pulling towards my stickers a lot more which have been in my stash for a while so it is nice to use these stickers. Um, I've also been using these little arrows I got from designer paper that was a chevron pattern and I just cut it into arrow shapes. And I did add a brad also in this page. So this one's probably my bulkiest page with the brad and the wood veneer. But um, I did combine photos and designer paper in the um, pockets. And then here's the back title page again using my alphabet stickers. And these were just photos I had from events we went to before I knew I was pregnant. So just had little titles for those. And then the bottom three pockets were my journaling to tell the story of the few symptoms I thought I had but I totally ignored before I found out and confirmed that I was pregnant. So making these layouts, again, I have pulled towards my alphabet stickers, washi tape, and then I did pull, um, like I said, a little bit more of my brads and wood veneer. So here again is the still photo of the first page front, and then here's the back. And then now we'll move on to page three. So this one had a lot more journaling, which is from my journal, like I said, that I kept, um, that I'm keeping a log of things going on for my pregnancy. So here's again a close up. I again included some more stamping for the date and again alphabet stickers with my journaling. And the month and the day I have um, now two different stamp sets that I'm using. Again, all journaling and little strips of designer paper. Some more stickers. And I think the stickers are the things that I'm using the most so far in Project Life that have been in my stash that I hardly ever use for other projects. So it is nice to use my stash for these layouts. And again, a lot of journaling. And then again, here's my title page for the back. More alphabet stickers, as you can see, and some buttons, actually more stamping and journaling and I'm actually able to use my date stamp as well which I have which just has the date it's not one of those fancy ones um, and again I have some of these labels on my photos which I use that pick monkey app or um, website to print my photos and to get these text on my photo and again just the accent of washi tape and some stickers so here's the still photos coming up of these pages um, thank you for stopping by. I hope you're enjoying these layouts and I think maybe in future videos I'll actually record myself putting these layouts together in the future. So thanks for stopping by.